There you go. I never counted it, but there must be 500 different kinds of varieties of fish every single night down here. The first cut you can make is right behind the head. Like that. Like Not, not, no. I'm telling you. And on these tags, it's got the uh, the identification, basically, of, of the fishermen. So they know where the fish came from and who caught it. We'll do double-digit millions this year, and uh, double that, and then double that, and double that. So it's a, it's a fast-growing business. We're an information company. We're not really a fish company. We just happen to sell fish. The biggest initial problem was understanding what the supply chain looks like because it's so obtuse and contorted, uh, and then mapping all of that into systems. The average piece of seafood in this country touches hands five to 15 times from dock to door. The reason that 25 to 40% of product in this country is mislabeled by the time it reaches the end consumer is the result of that many hands that are touching it all the way through the chain. There were no warehouse management systems that could handle such a perishable product. There was no packaging that could successfully get product from here to the middle of Kansas uh, and have the product arrive fresh. The original market started in 1822 uh, down on Fulton Street and it was an outdoor market. They had some shacks. So in the summer it was hot, in the winter it was cold. Fish was right out there for you to select from and they would pick their fish. Our guys walk around with handhelds and iPads and they pick out the product from wherever it looks best. Mm -hmm. um, we secure the product, take it down to our shop and transform it from what's effectively a 3,000 year old business to um, an Amazon warehouse. 